Hi, I'm Dr. Rahul Bharad. I welcome you all to my series What Life Has Taught Me Yesterday. Today, when I'm recording this video is 10th of December 2023. I'll be talking what 9th of December has taught me in life. <clears throat> Every day in our clinical practice, we doctors, especially pediatricians and neonatologists, we come across many situations where uh, there is need for caesarean section uh, for birth of the baby. Now, most of the people who are not even doctors, they know this term caesarean section and uh, normal delivery. So when it is needed to be done, the caesarean section, that decision is usually uh, taken by obstetrician on duty, the doctor on duty, gynecologist and obstetrician people. They are more <clears throat> concerned about uh, their decision about uh, when they should go for caesarean section. Many a times, even uh, every relative wants uh, their patient to deliver the baby uh, by normal vaginal delivery but it is not possible sometimes. So the timing and the decision to do caesarean section is of utmost importance. I came across a situation where uh, timely decision of caesarean section was very helpful for a mother and the baby and no complication was there because of the timely decision to do caesarean section and willingness of the parents and uh, their ability to recognize the problem early and get ready and follow whatever doctor's advice. So what was that incident I'll be talk talking about today in the most important lesson I got from yesterday's life. Most important news I came across yesterday is about Aditya L1 mission. Aditya L1 mission we all know is for getting more information about our son, the son and uh, it has sent a very beautiful image of the complete disc image of the sun where you can see even sun spots and various regions on the sun uh, in detail. So what is that news about uh, that I'll be discussing in this video. Most trending news I came across yesterday is about third ODI international which was played uh, between England and West Indies. Now recently after World Cup England is touring West Indies and we all know West Indies was not part of the World Cup because they could not qualify for the World Cup. Despite so bad performance of their team over the few years in the past, West Indies has, they have won the series 2-1 and they have beaten England 2-1 in the ODI series out of 3 ODIs. What is that trending news I will be discussing at the end of the video. What is interesting thing about that I will be talking. Most important lesson I got from yesterday is that uh, being a neonatologist uh, I know that uh, it is not my area of decision when to operate, when to go for season section or when to uh, deliver the uh, baby by normal vaginal delivery but I attend so many calls uh, by uh, many times normal delivery, sometimes caesarean section. I get the feeling that most of the time parents, uh, they refuse for caesarean section. Uh, they immediately change the hospital when whenever they are asked by the doctor for to go for caesarean section. We all have to understand, even if you are not a doctor, you, we have to understand that there are some medical conditions where it is not possible to deliver that baby by a normal vaginal delivery. Now, mind you, every doctor, every obstetrician wants uh, the child to be delivered by normal vagina delivery unless it is medically indicated. If it is medically indicated and if it is not possible to deliver the, medic uh, the child by normal vagina delivery, there is no point in discussing or even trying for uh, normal vagina delivery because what happens if it is not possible to deliver the baby vaginally in some specific medical conditions and if still that condition is continued the either the baby or the mother will def or both might have serious health consequences so that is the thing which i just wanted to share with you all uh, i am not the person you can consult your obstetrician whenever uh, such conditions arises they would be in a proper position to tell you whether this uh, mother can deliver by normal vaginal delivery or uh, will have to go for cesarean section most important lesson i got from yesterday's life is that I came across a situation where uh, normal trial of uh, trial of normal delivery was done but it was not possible to deliver the baby. Immediately the parents were informed and parents got ready for the caesarean section after consultation by the doctor on duty and 
uh, immediately action was taken immediately seizure and section was done and baby uh, is quite good mother is in quite good health and that has saved so many hazardous complications that could have arise uh, because of the normal delivery trial if at all it was prolonged so timely decision to go for caesarean section uh, is the decision which is to be taken by the obstetrician and must be followed immediately by the parents if this happens whenever it is needed uh, that will give all the good results which even every doctor every patient and every relative wants now i am not here to tell you that uh, every delivery or every pregnant lady should go for caesarean section i am not the authority to tell you about that what i am saying is whenever the doctor on duty the obstetrician tells you that it is needed we have parents have to consider that it is in good health of mother and good health of the baby the decision to go for caesarean section so that is the point just wanted to share with you what is your opinion about that do tell me in the comment box uh, please 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 follow your doctor's advice if you don't have faith in this world you cannot communicate with anyone suppose if you go to a uh, shop and you want something or if you go to a temple and if you don't have faith on that god better you don't go to the temple and better you don't go to the shop to buy something you must have faith you must have consistently uh, developed a rapport with the doctor under which you are treating your patient then on then only you can get better results so that is the point i just wanted to share with you all because that was the most important lesson i got from yesterday's life no point in discussing which patient was there and what were the complications and what was the condition the most important thing is mother is healthy baby is healthy because of the proper decision taken timely by the doctors to deliver that child normally or cesarean section that is the decision which is to be taken by obstetrician and yesterday we could have healthy mother healthy baby because of the timely decision of the cesarean section most important news i came across yesterday is about aditya l1 mission we all know few uh, days back isro had sent uh, after success of chandrayaan 3 isro had sent aditya l1 mission towards the sun and it is expected to reach the lagrange point l1 while going that to up to that that point uh, now aditya l1 has sent a beautiful image of the sun it has used 11 filters to capture that image and it's a full disk sun's image i'll be sharing link in the description box if you really want to know all those images 11 images also plus that is the images where you can see very beautiful image of the sun it's in green hue uh, you can definitely go to the description box and click on the link what it has added that it is showing some of the uh, sun spots also some of the plague regions on the sun also some of the quiet areas of the sun also now where there is no not much activity on the sun those areas also are marked uh, with the help of this image it has used wavelength of very fine 200 to 400 nanometer wavelength it has used to capture these images it has been captured by the telescope which is named as suit now sun's ultraviolet imaging telescope its uh, long form is the suit telescope has been made and prepared with the help of students and of uh, institute which is located in the pune city of maharashtra so we all maharashtrian people should be proud that pune has contributed significantly to the preparation and manufacturing of the isro's aditya l1 what is the future that uh, these images and all will make us understand better about the photosphere and chromosphere layers of the sun and this will allow us to develop or predict what is going to happen in future about as far as heat from the sun is concerned so that's very useful data which we are gathering uh, please go to the description box and link uh, uh, click on the link get more information about that most trending news i came across yesterday is about england west indies third odi which happened yesterday what is the significance about that uh, match i would say is that this series was Uh, started after the end of the world cup after england got defeated significantly in this last odi world cup and england could not qualify for the semi final they were hoping that they can take some revenge uh, against west indies who had already not qualified for the world cup but it did not happen west indies won the series by 2-1 and in the third match 
West Indies won it uh, with almost 14-16 balls to spare with the help of Duckworth Lewis system. What is the most important thing in that match is that newer bowlers, Matthew Ford, a newer bowler has taken three wickets from West Indies. Newer captain uh, of West Indies, Shai Hope was awarded man of the series in that uh, final match, third ODI. But what it signifies is that even if West Indies had not qualified for the World Cup, England had performed very badly in the World Cup. Despite that, England could not win the series against ODI. So that was the most important and most trending news I just wanted to share with you all. If you really like all these discussions and if you get anything pos positive from these discussions or if you get anything more informative from these discussions, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. For today, we'll stop here. Bye-bye.